What's up, ladies and gents? Social Nurse here. Thank you so much for stopping by my channel. I really do appreciate your time. I'm going to talk about media mogul Byron Allen. This guy is really wealthy. He owns the Grio, and the Grio is the website, thegrio.com. This article is what I'm referencing, right? And the headline of this article is Federal Judge rules Byron Allen's $10 billion lawsuit against McDonald's for racial discrimination will go to trial. The latest ruling in a lawsuit filed by Allen's media companies is held as historic as Allen uses a post-Civil Civil War statute in his bid against the fast food chain, right? So this lawsuit will proceed in a California federal court, according to a U.S. district, United States district judge. There's sufficient evidence for the suit filed against McDonald's by Allen's media companies under Section 1981 of the Civil Rights Act of 1866. The lawsuit alleges that McDonald's blocked Allen and his media properties from McDonald's general market ad agency responsible for dispersing the vast majority of McDonald's massive ad budget. According to the courts, McDonald's spends mil hundreds of millions of dollars each year to advertise its products in national media. Allen's lawsuit claims his companies were regulated to McDonald's black only ad agency, which has a significant smaller budget. Allen's lawsuit argues that despite an annual pleas for the Allen media companies to be included in McDonald's general ad market, Allen's groups remain in the black only market because Allen is black, right? So that's what Byron Allen is saying. He's saying that his media companies remained in the black only ad market or black only market because Byron Allen is black. So uh, I like to see how this turns out. Byron Allen is already filthy rich. So if he doesn't win this case, I, I, ten billion dollars is a lot. Uh, if he doesn't win, hmm, he still doesn't have anything to worry about. But it is considered historic because I mentioned eighteen sixty six is a statute that they are using to pursue this case. The law used in Allen's suit against McDonald's is a post a post-Civil War statute that allowed all persons within the jurisdiction of the United States to have the same right to uphold contracts as is enjoyed by white citizens. The law's objective was to safeguard Black enterprise from racial discrimination during America's Reconstruction era. Just one year after the Civil War ended, freeing enslaved African Americans from centuries of bondage, right? So there you have it, folks. Uh, we'll see what happens. So Ronald McDonald uh, is probably going to be pictured in the saddest way in this video commentary that I'm doing, social nurse.